xin chào khán giả FPT Play tôi là Hendrio cầu thủ câu lạc bộ Tep Sang Nam Định Henrio Araujo da Silva sinh ngày 16 tháng 5 năm 1994 là một trong những học viên lò đào tạo chữ danh La Masia của câu lạc bộ Barcelona. Cầu thủ người Brazil bén duyên với bóng đá Việt Nam vào đầu năm 2021 để khoác áo câu lạc bộ Topelen Bình Định. Thi đấu cho đội bóng đất võ trong hai mùa giải, Henrio đã để lại nhiều dấu ấn khi góp công lớn vào thành tích giành huy chương đồng V-League và vị trí Á quân Cúp Quốc gia của đội bóng này. Chính sự thăng hoa của Henrio là tác nhân khiến các đội bóng lớn nhòm ngó đến anh và trong cuộc chiến tranh giành ngôi sao tuyến giữa này, thép xanh Nam Định là những người thắng cuộc. Dù thời gian thi đấu cho đội bóng thành Nam là chưa nhiều, nhưng phẩm chất ngôi sao của Henrio đã được bộc lộ khi anh thể hiện mình là ông chủ đích thực khu trung tuyến. Trong một cấp bậc đèn với tới V-League của FPT Play, Hi everyone, uh, I am Andrew, professional football player. Uh, I'm from Brazil, from Brasilia, the capital. And I am 28 years old. Uh, but I moved from, from Brazil to Spain when I was 10 years old. Uh, always playing football. Like uh, my family is two members, three members, like me, my brother, older brother, and my mom. And uh, yeah, so I grew up in Spain, started play football there also. In many clubs, I, I, I did all my academy um, there in Spain. And yeah, now I am in Vietnam and very happy to be here. I really enjoy, like I, I feel like it's my second house. I don't know why, like uh, it's my third year here. And uh, I already feel like uh, I live here a long time, have many friendship, like mm, many good friends. So I feel very comfortable here. Like I said before, like I felt since the day one I was here, like uh, my home. I don't know if it's because of my personality, this match with Vietnam people. So I felt very good since day one, and uh, I, I I didn't need like a lot of time to adapt not really so i felt okay and i think uh, vietnam football match with my style yeah from like i i grow grow up in brazil until 11 years old and then i i moved to spain so since young in brazil i play football so yeah when i moved to spain start play more like uh, uh, how i can say like academies football like to, to form form your tactics side your your technique side but i think the same in brazil in brazil was the, the the place where i i grew up and start play yeah la masia is different different world i always say that because they care about uh, minimum details like it's a different academy and that's the reason why they they form they form uh, like many players for, for, for the, the football world. I think everything like uh, not only like a football player like a personality also you know like they care about uh, small details like to, to make you humble to make you be strong mind have strong mind to because in football is very important. So that's the main thing like I, I think I learned from there and helped me a lot. And also like the technique, the tactic style like in, in football, 
part is very important. I don't think so. Like I always say, everything happened because because a reason. So I think I learned a lot there, and um, in that moment I I missed my family a lot. I was far away. So yeah, it was a good time, but I, I learned from that also. So not wrong decision. Yeah, it's a good memory. I played for Portugal three years in Portugal in first first division, and uh, for sure he's a good goalkeeper. He's, he's a le le legend. So for me, well, I was excited. And then uh, after that, like two years after that, he he retired for, from football. So for me, it was a special memory. It's a special memory. Uh, it's only a few months wearing that shirt but for me it's so special already like um, I think in the stadium is always full the defense is crazy by like by the club so for me it's, it's special because there's a lot of responsibility when you have a lot of people playing to, to see you play and going to the stadium to, to watch your game so you have to give 100% all the time. Yeah, we always have to, to dream about it. I think if you don't dream about it, you, you don't have ambition. So you have to dream about the highest possible. Uh, and uh, Namdin, for sure Namdin also, we, we, we have to, to dream about it, work for that. But uh, yeah, why not? We have to work a lot. We because it's a lot of new players, so we have to match. This time, this break, I think is helping us to, to, to match to each other, like to connect, build connection. And uh, yeah, we start very well, like uh, four games without lose. And we have to keep this up and keep working hard. And then step by step, we will see. The young is em đánh giá thì cậu ta là một người cầu thủ rất có chuyên nghiệp và chuyên môn rất cao. Sau một thời gian khoảng độ 3 tháng để làm việc cùng bạn Helio thì em thấy bạn là một người có tính cách hiền lành, hòa đồng và đặc biệt là trong công việc thì cậu ấy rất là chuyên nghiệp, chăm chỉ tập luyện. Điểm mạnh của cậu thì sự khéo léo, nhãn quan chiến thuật rất tốt và có cái chân trái rất hay. I hear a lot of good things about him before, like before I came here, because I asked to, to see with who I will work. And um, for sure, like it's all just confirmation, like when I was here since day one, he, he made me feel comfortable. He made me feel mm, confident to help the club and uh, give me the confidence enough to, to, to do my job. So I only have good works for him and good words. And yeah, I, I hope we can get the goals together. Um, many people asked me that because I had some offers. So I always say because for me it's important is the project. Like uh, they have a very good project with ambition. Um, is a new start for Namdin. So this motivate me. I like challenge, and this was a good reason. To, to decide to go to Nandi. Yeah, so I received an offer from another countries uh, in, in the southeast of Asia, but um, there's no reason to move. Like, uh, I feel comfortable here, and for me, that's important. I feel, I feel comfortable, happy, and, um, and um, like the affection from people, so, no, I see no reason to move, and especially I am adapted and used here to the league, to, to people, to lifestyle. So that's the main reason I stay. Yeah, I think V League is a bit is complicated. Playing in V League is not easy because it's a lot of uh, good clubs, and people maybe around the world they don't know the how difficult is play here, and. Um, yeah, it's uh, take time, take time to adapt a bit and and to 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 get used to the league. Like um, 
but it's, it's, it's a league who is growing step by step and I think will will be better every year. Yeah, I always say like, uh, let's see, in the future we never know, but uh, now I, what I can say is like, I feel very comfortable here in Vietnam and I have many, many plans for the future, like to stay here and let's see what happens, but why not? I love Vietnam and why not uh, do some investment here and stay here for long. Yeah, I have a lot of tattoos, so like my tattoos all have meaning um, and the uh, count, it's, it's about, talk about a bit my history from, from where I grow, the way I, I grow and uh, every one, every tattoo, all tattoo is special, but uh, it's a recent one I, I, I made in my neck, yeah, so it's um, um, represent like my brother, me and my mom. Yeah, my mom the rose and we. So thank you everyone to to follow our series in TV League by FPT Play and keep following us, following us, keep uh, watching us and and support Tepsap Namding.